Hi, welcome to my channel. This is a Heath Kit 2718 triple output power supply. I built this as a kit a long time ago. I'm thinking maybe 1982. And it's been in storage for a long time. I wonder if the caps are all dried out. So you can see here it has a fixed 5 volt 1.5 amp supply. Let's go ahead and turn this on. Take a chance. And put it on volts. Looks like there's 5 volts there. At least on the meter. Indicating 5 volts. And it has two outputs here. Zero. Variable to zero to 20 volts. 0.5 amps. And they can be independent for tracking supplies. So let's switch over to supply A on volts and let's vary up to 0 to 20. That's independent. And we can switch to supply B. Varies up to 20 volts. And we have this tracking. At A, B, so let's open it up, take a look inside, see if it jogs any memories for me. So let's remove the cover. Pretty large transformer. I'll have to see if I can find the manual and the schematic for this. Must have it around somewhere. I've got a 12,000 microfarad capacitor here. And it looks like there's just a half wave rectifier there. And there's the tracking power supply. Have a fuse inside here. Oh, there is a date in here. And it's 86, 1986. Now that says Heathkit Electronic Center. So I'm wondering if when I wired this, uh, I, there was a problem that I could not find because I know you could take it in uh, to the local Heath kit. They'd have a service center there. I don't recall if they would just send it out, but they would solve whatever problem that you could not solve when you built a kit. So I don't know if I should just go ahead and replace these electrolytics or wait for something to fail, but hopefully I can use this in some of my experiments. So let me put the cover back on. So that's the Heath Kit 2718 triple power supply. I might have to go to something like DigiKey, order some electrolytic capacitors and replace all the electrolytics. But hopefully for the time being I can use this to power up some of my test or prototype circuits. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and or comment. See ya.